Comedian Pete Davidson is in a war of words with the animal rights group PETA. And it's all over this cutie pie of a puppy. It's a Cavapoo, a designer dog created by mixing a Cavalier King Charles Spaniel with a poodle. PETA went after the popular comic after video emerged of Pete and his girlfriend buying a dog from this pet store in New York City instead of adopting one from a shelter. Cavapoos can cost as much as $5,000. Says PETA, it's tragic that Pete didn't seek out a mutt from a city animal shelter because a scrappy New Yorker with charm, personality, and unconventional handsomeness could have been his perfect match. If it was meant as a backhanded compliment, it didn't work. Hi, my name is Pete Davidson. Pete struck back in a voicemail message that he left with PETA that boiled over with anger. I just want to let you know I'm severely allergic to dogs, so I have to get a specific breed. I'm only not allergic to cavapoos, and my mom's dog, who was two years old, died a week prior, and we're all so sad, so I had to get a specific dog. So why don't you do your research before you create news stories for people because you're a boring, tired you and End of message. This is Layla, and while she is adorable, veterinarians agree there really is no such thing as a hypoallergenic dog. There's no such thing as a 100% hypoallergenic dog. Cavapoos are usually considered more hypoallergenic than other breeds. It's the poodle hair in them. Pete. Davidson had nothing to say about the controversy on the red carpet last night. PETA says Davidson has told them he's apologetic for leaving the expletive loaded voicemail but he's not sorry for standing up for his family. And by the way, he's keeping the dog. Davidson said he lost his cool because he's still so upset over his mother's dog passing away.